Hello friends, let us now learn about one more glycogen storage disease which is type 6, type 5, type 5 glycogen storage disease which is called as MacArdell's disease. You can remember M for muscle. So here the problem in this MacArdell's disease is mainly the deficiency of muscle, M for muscle phosphorylase defect. And because the muscle phosphorylase is defective, this will limit the muscle ATP generation by glycogenolysis. So as a result, glycogen gets accumulated in the cells. Okay, this occurs due to the defect of the enzyme, defect of the gene PYGM mutation on chromosome 11Q13. Okay, if you see the clinical features, here all the symptoms of muscles are mainly present. So first and foremost, the patient suffers from exercise intolerance and there will be muscle cramps and muscle pains are seen in these patients. So first appearance of muscle pain, the baby stops and afterwards uh, this will resume exercise with more ease. That is the characteristic feature where there is first appearance of pain then they will slow down and then afterwards they will resume the exercise then they, they do not feel that much pain. It, it is, is There will be more, more ease after resuming the exercise. This mainly presents in childhood and are as an adult. Okay. So here if you see if, if the, here in this there is muscle phosphorylase deficiency. So whenever there is exercise there is rhabdomyolysis will occur and this rhabdomyolysis the myoglobin is uh, broken down through this rhabdomyolysis and as a result this myoglobin is excreted sorry myoglobin is excreted in the urine causing myoglobin urea which gives a burgundy color urine uh, okay burgundy color to the urine due to this myoglobin urea this is one thing which you should remember then if you diagnose it you see you can uh, do a screening test and this screening test is we have ischemic exercise test can be used as a screening test and if there is no increase in blood lactate and no increase in ammonia, it's seen. If blood lactate and ammonia are not increased, then definitely you can rule out liver issues. So as a result, then you can think that it is due to muscle defect. And you can also do the enzyme studies can be done for diagnosing this McArdle's disease. Then if you do the treatment, treatment is always avoid exercise. And always, even if you have to do exercise, Definitely, we should do exercise and our daily works. So before exercise, you should give glucose to the patient or you can give sucrose to the patient. And you can also supplement vitamin B6 to these patients. So this is about type 5 or McArdle's disease. You can remember McArdle's for muscle and all the symptoms are in the muscle. Okay, and they are precipitated by exercise. Next. The next... So thank you guys for watching my lecture. Thank you.